All right, Jonathan, uh, thank you so much for uh, joining Ben and I today. How are you doing? Man, I'm doing awesome. This is exciting stuff. Uh, it, it really excited to be with you and Ben. Yeah, it's our pleasure. Thank you. Uh, of course, let's just jump right into it. So uh, officially, I want to welcome you back to um, Keller Williams Realty. So welcome home. Yeah, We're, man, uh, thank you. Back. I'm excited. This is uh, this is going to be an exciting video. And thank you for that welcome. I tell you, it just it feels really, really good to be back. Oh, I bet. Now, let me, you've been in real estate. I mean, like your family's been, I, I think that your family invented real estate. <laughs> well, uh, I don't know about that, but I, I will tell you, I was the person that said, I'm never going to do this. I'm never going to be in real estate. And I was the last person, but yeah, my, my entire family from my grandmother, my mother, my sister, my brother, my cousins, my aunts, my, my wife. Uh, and I literally was the last person to, to get on the real estate bandwagon. I can only imagine your family, like at a family reunion, going out to eat at a restaurant, <laughs> trying to figure out a tip with a multiple of 6%. <laughs> yeah, that's right, man. <laughs> like, like, no, 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 6%, do three of those, and we'll, we'll do four of those, because it's great service. Like, or, like, or, or, or how about, uh, how about your, your, you just are used to your mother hanging up on you mid-sentence in a conversation on the phone because she gets a sign call. That happens nonstop. <laughs> Uh, and, and she still calls me every day to tell me how many listings she's, she's been in business 47 years and wow. she still calls me and tells me, uh, what she did in, in, in real estate, which I love, you know, I love to hear her That's telling cool. her success stories and, and what she's done. So. That's so right. I love it. All right. So you guys been around in real estate uh, since the beginning of time. Um, in 2000, you first, this is not your first welcome to KW. No. I think the KW um, and at some point, like chewed through the straps and escaped. But you came to KW originally in like, I mean, I've known you forever, 2011, 2010, yeah. 12. Yeah, man, right around that time, uh, uh, 20, right around 2011. Uh, so, so my mother owned her own brokerage. I was doing some real estate training in our market. I was an agent working at my mom's office, which there was zero training for, right? When I got into the business, my mom said, you know, here's your desk, here's your phone, you're on your own, go get them. And I'm like, go get what? What What am I supposed to go get? And uh, I started, my dad was like, you need a call for sale by owners. And, and that's a whole nother story. But that's how I started in the business. And then as I began to gain some success, I started teaching and training in our board. And that opened up the door for me. I'll never forget uh, Marilyn Stubbs, an agent in our market. She came up to me after a training. She said, I put your name in the hat for team leader in our office. And I said, fantastic. And I didn't know what that meant. Sounds good. <laughs> what the hell is that? <laughs> yeah. And, uh, and then I received a phone call uh, a couple of weeks later. And the next thing you know, I'm in this, uh, um, uh, process is interview process. And, and I, uh, eight weeks later was the team leader <laughs> at a Keller Williams office. So that, that's my story into, to, and I'll never forget. I was like, man, is this process ever going to end? Like I, I've, I've already taken a, a, a bottle of, of Advil through, through sure. this. I, I've shared my life story eight times, oh, yeah. uh, but it was, it was an awesome experience. And, and I loved being a team leader. Oh my gosh. You know, and uh, anybody who's been through, like our hiring process, you know, can, can relate to that feeling of it takes forever, and, you know, and yeah, we, we appreciate you going through it. So in 2011, that happened. Um, then you left the organization uh, 2013, 2014, about that time frame, if I remember right, was it about then? Yeah, it was tw 2015. I left uh, to and and I left to go start my own brokerage. Yeah, it's uh, but I, you know, I came from a family of independent broker owners, and I said I'm going to go do this. And yeah. and we left, and and we built um, the largest independent brokerage in the state of Louisiana, and we were the fourth largest real estate company in Baton Rouge out of about 800 uh, uh, brokerages, and and just had a had a great run. And um, due to just uh, unforeseen issues with one with one of my uh, partners he got sick and we made a decision to move in a different uh, um, way and so we, we closed our brokerage and, and transitioned over to exp and what what year was that that was in uh, a year a little over a year and a half ago yeah I, I was gonna get I was gonna say just under two years so kW 2011 left uh, to start your own independent did well with that. Uh, ben, you knew Jonathan and know oh, yeah. Jonathan from 
Keller Williams. Yeah, from team leader days, absolutely. We we were team leader buddies, and yeah. and uh, we uh, I, I called Ben. I called Ben because uh, um, t- two months ago. I received a call to come out and meet with Gary Keller. And I was like, Gary Keller, I want to meet with me. And I, and I called Ben. I was like, Ben, I need your help, man. Is this a real, is this legit? And uh, it, it, it changed my world. Well, and Jonathan, to that point, I remember uh, over the course of the last few months, you were calling me telling me why I should come to EXP. <laughs> <laughs> and I was telling you like, Hey man, I got the pleasure of being able to meet with Gary a few times and what he's building and doing. It'll, it'll knock your socks off. No one's done it before. That's right. It's revolutionary. And you and I talked since. It was one of those things that's easy to hear, but you didn't quite appreciate it until you actually were there seeing it with your own eyes, right? Yeah, I tell you, you know, I, I walked in the house. I, I took that phone call at, um, from Keller Williams. I walked outside and I came back in and I told my wife, I said, I just got this call and, and uh, they want me to go to Austin and, and meet with Gary Keller. And when I was a team leader, I'd never met him. I just saw sure. Gary from the platform. And uh, you know, and, and I taught all his stuff. I mean, I have forever, uh, you know, the MREA and, uh, it's all I've been teaching for, for, forever, even before I was at KW as a team leader. And, um, I told my wife, I said, I'm going to go, I'm going to go meet with him. I mean, how often do you get that phone call? And, uh, and Ben had been telling me, you know, Hey, look, we've, we've been seeing, we're, we're, we're hanging out right where we are because Gary's back in action and he's really involved at a high level. And, uh, and and I experienced that for a, for a full month because I came one day a week for about a month to Austin and, and really got to know Gary and experience that and just connect at a really high level. You know, Gary mentioned to me, gosh, it had to be a week ago, maybe. He said, you know what? Right now, this instant in time, he said, I feel like I'm working harder than I've ever worked. He said, if I'm not, I'm certainly working as hard as I've ever worked and as much as I've ever worked. Uh, but he smiled and said, but I'm having a blast. Like I'm, I'm enjoying it and having fun. And he goes, you know what? Uh, the first day I'm not having fun around here is the last day I want to be. Like I'm working hard and I'm having a blast. And I mean, and it shows. Yeah, it shows, right? So you start hanging out. You start coming back to Austin. Um, you're meeting with Gary. Uh, you've been around real estate for a really long time. You're hard to, I mean, like you've heard a bunch of promises. You've heard a bunch of stuff. Like you're, it's got to be hard to impress you at this point. You're not just going, oh, that sounds awesome. Let's do that. Like you're not, you're not yeah. a guy. So what on earth did you hear? And, and we just have a couple of moments, a couple of minutes maybe, but what did you hear that you said, you know what? I'm going to, I'm, I'm not just going to align with this. I'm going to realign yeah, with this. It's almost, back. yeah, it's almost yeah. like getting a divorce and then dating that person <laughs> a few years later and going, well, I don't know, maybe, like maybe we should try this. Like that's kind of what it's like for you. I mean, yeah, no, that's a great way to great way to put it. You know, I, I'll share just this real quick. Story. I don't know if I'd say great way to put it. Got, got really <laughs> that's kind of what it's like. It, it is what it's like. It's, that's a great analogy. But you know, the, the best way I can put it is this. So, so I wear glasses. Without my glasses, I can't see. I can't read my phone. My kids they right. they dog me out all the time because my text on my phone is as big as you can possibly make it, even <laughs> though I wear progressive lenses. And when I had to go get glasses, uh, I'm sitting in the doctor's chair, and my doctor, Doctor Rogers, he's he put the writings on the wall, right? He puts the letters up, and he's like, "Read me the third row." And and I just paused and I was like, man, I just would be making stuff up. Honestly, can, can I do the first letter? Can I do that row? I think that's an E. And, uh, and then he starts shifting the lenses around and all of a sudden I'll never forget. I was like, Oh my gosh, I can see that. And uh, that, that's it. That's perfect. That's the experience I had when I met with Gary, you know, I, you, you hear the shifts happening in the industry. And when I was with him, I saw there's really these two battles. Uh, and Seth Campbell, I, I thought, presented this brilliantly in a, in a Facebook post. But you've got this battle, battle over, yeah. over agent count. And, and that battle really has already, already been won. And then you have this battle that only Gary Keller seems to be fighting for the agent, which is the battle to make sure that the real estate agent stays relevant in the transaction. And when I saw that and what he was really doing 
and I saw the technology and I saw the vision and I saw the passion and I saw this is a, I mean, this is like a, a, a movement that, that he's going after. And how you said he's back and like he, he's working harder than he ever had. That would terrify me if I were his competitor. That really would. I'd be like, <laughs> he is on his game and he's passionate about what he's doing. But when you think about it, he's been in real estate his whole life too. And, and I, I, I look at that and I said, you know, I come from a family of, of real estate agents. I love the real estate industry. Uh, it's not just about money. It's not just about recruiting talent. It's, uh, it's about preserving our industry and keeping the agent in the center of that transaction to better serve the consumer and, and to stay relevant. And I said, that is a battle that I can fight with him. I want to link arms and be a part of, of this movement to keep the agent in the game and relevant in the industry. Does that make sense? Uh, it makes perfect Absolutely. sense. I mean, it's like a, it's almost like a battle cry. Mm -hmm. It's almost like a yeah. battle cry that, you know, anybody who's been around real estate for a long time and, and, and almost, I don't know, Jonathan, almost anybody who, who desires to be around real estate for a long time to come. Mm -hmm. It's yeah. like, listen, if you've got 12 months left, you need a few more listings who cares? and you're gone, yeah. who cares? But That's right. Out and you're going, you know what? Like, this is my career field. Yep. This is where I'm going to be for a really long time. Like, it's either I'm going to be here for a really long time or it's I've been here for a long time and I care about this industry. Yep. It's one of those right. two. Um, though somebody who fits one of those two says, this matters to me. Mm -hmm. Like, this is important it's to me. It's worth right? fighting for. Yeah. yeah. And, I, and I, I don't, you know, Gary made the comment the other day. He said, I don't think this is something where we just lackadaisically fold up our arms and say, well, we'll see what happens. Yeah, you can't. You, you just, you can't, you can't do it. Yeah. This is the opportunity that we have as a group to say, here's what could happen. Mm -hmm. Here's where we, here's where we're going to go instead. Everything's like, online. This is yeah. what we're going to do instead because everything can look so different. So. Well, and, 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 and that's, that's spot on. And the, and the, the, the second part of that in that conversation he had with me, it was really interesting because he said, Jonathan, I was meeting with this agent the other day and uh, we were talking about their business. And, and I just asked him, I said, what have you, what have you taken away from Century 21? Like what'd you take away that you applied to your business and helped you? What book did you read from Century 21 that helped you? And the guy said, well, nothing. What, what about, and he just started listing all these companies. It didn't matter what company he's listing every company. And then he says, how about KW? What, what did you take away? Anything from KW? He said, that's oh, how I built my business. It's how I modeled my business. It's how I, the systems and the models that I've, I've used. And, and then he was sharing with me how the industry really now teaches his models. And I, and I was just sat there and went, that's all I teach. I mean, I'm, I'm teach all the time and it's all, all it's all your stuff. <laughs> That's what I said. And, and, uh, and so being, being back in that environment where you're, 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 you've got people passionate about educating agents at the highest level possible and passionate about creating this movement to keep the real estate agent relevant in the transaction man, it's just, uh, it, I said, I, I, I want to align myself with this organization and this is a battle that I can, I can go fight for. I think I speak for our organization when I say, when we look across the globe and think, what are some of the greatest people out there who walk the planet to fight this fight with? Man, Jonathan, we're we're honored that you're that you're back in business with us, and you're you're carrying that same flag for the age. So exciting! Awesome. Well, listen, I, I'm excited too, guys, and uh, I, I really appreciate you guys taking time today to chat with me about it. Uh, Welcome so home. Welcome back, <laughs> Thanks, man. I appreciate it.